Cole has the sign. And the right-handers pitch. Breaking ball. Swung on and lifted to left field. It drops in a base hit. Cruz will score. Bay is right behind him. Throw goes toward third. And Castro dives in head first. He is there safely. That's a Stands without batting gloves. Holding a two-tone bat away from his body. Here's a 1-0. This one swung on and lifted to deep center. Sending De La Rosa back. It is over his head and down on the warning track. One bounce in off the wall. Castro is in to score. Here comes Sawinski. And into second with an RBI double is Daniel Amaral. It is 4-0 Altoona. Fastball low and away that Amaral is able to take the opposite field. Just a great swing there by the Altoona left fielder. Able to lift that one out into the right. Left-hander Cruz has the sign. And a 2-0. Swung on and lifted to right center field. This ought to be deep enough to get it done as the center fielder Frazier ventures into the alley and makes the catch. Tagging for third and scoring without a throw is Andrew Navagato. It is 4-1 Altoona here in the fifth inning after the sack fly from Dane Myers. A timeout call by a batter can really affect a pitcher and his rhythm. Here's a 1-0. Carpenter swings and lifts it into right field. That one drops in for a base hit. Touching third and turning for home is De La Rosa. And up to third base goes Dingler. RBI single from Kerry Carpenter. And it is 4-2 here in the top half of the fifth inning. Left-hander Kirby appears ready in the Altoona bullpen. Looks like he's going to have the sixth. Here's a 2-0. Sawinski takes in the dirt. It skips away off to the first base side. Here comes Martin. He crosses home on a wild pitch, and it's 5-2 Altoona. Right-hander has the sign. Holds his glove ready, holding it close to his chest. 3-0 pitch. Sawinski swings and lines it to right field. That's a base hit. Frazier touches third. He turns for home. Right fielder Carpenter's throw is cut off. Throw goes towards second. Sawinski is in there safely. That's an RBI single for Jack. And the curve lead at 6-2. Beast League, the only other is happening down at the Diamond where the Rubber Ducks are taking on Richmond. Akron leading that one 7-5. They're into the top of the fifth. 2-2 two -two pitch is swung on a miss for strike three, but it's a wild pitch getting all the way to the backstop. Scoring on the play will be De La Rosa. Shortstop Navigato playing behind the base runner at second. Here's a 1-2 pitch to Cruz. This one swung on and lined toward the alley in right center field. That's down for a base hit. One bounce and off the wall. Connor Kaiser's going to score easily. O'Neal Cruz replaces him at second with a run scoring double. It is 7-3 Altoona here in the eighth inning. 